To edit to your profile, simply click on the cog at the top left, or you can click on your profile icon at the top right. The little badge at the side of the profile icon indicates that you are a premium member or belong to a corporate organization who supports you using CPDME as part of their package. Simply click on the icon and you then also get a banner that indicates that you are a CPDME premium member. You then have the options to access your CPD dashboard, which allows you to view all of your CPD online. You then have the option to edit your profile, which we will walk through in a second. Remove your passcode or add a passcode. Contact our support team. Log out of the app or request your account is deleted. Requesting delete account will delete your account along with all of your CPD entries. If you have any questions around this function, please contact our support team as once you have requested delete account, this is irreversible and you will lose everything you have submitted and uploaded to CPDME. To edit your profile, click on the edit profile option where you can change your name, your professional governing body, your job title, your nickname, and also an enforcement function, which is activate or deactivate push notifications. Activating or deactivating push notifications will allow us to let you know when we have got up and coming webinars, and also the app will let you know when you need to capture and record CPD, or if you have any functionality that requires you to be notified around your CPD requirements or regulations. Going back to the profile, if you have a password, you can remove this or you can add a password yourself. This will allow you to have all the functionality you need within the app to lock and secure the app and protect all of your CPD. You also have the option to contact support via either telephone, WhatsApp, accessing our frequently asked questions or contacting our centre to help or request support. You also have the option, as I said, to log out and delete at the very bottom of your screen. If you have any questions around your profile, please do drop us a message. It's always good if you click on the face at the top, you can edit a face by activating a camera or a gallery, and that will help you personalize your portfolio along with make your app develop a personal experience for you. Remember, you can contact us if you need support via either WhatsApp, scanning the QR code, or by email.